In addition to my electronic workbench setup, it would be really handy to have access to USB power or fiber supply, especially when charging mobile phones and other devices. Choosing from varieties of different multi-port charger, I found this most suitable in terms of size, thickness, and display orientation, and as a smart charger, it comes with the 7 ports USB-A and 1 USB-C port. So the 2.4 amps maximum current from port 1 to port 7 and at least 3 amps on the USB-C port. Another good thing with this one is you can monitor the current consumption on each port with a digital display. So let's open it up. So it comes with a two wire mains port for Australian market, a manual, and the multi port USB charger. So let's power it up. So let's plug the, the USB 7 to my smartphone. So it's charging at 66% and let's see the display, how much current. So it shows 1.9 to 2 amps. We'll disconnect. So the good thing that's a pretty handy that you can monitor the current and you can plug as many devices as you can. Here I can charge my LCR meter, Nano VNA, or the Victor analyzer. I can power it up using the charger, a tiny spectrum analyzer. You can plug this one in and also the camera uh, where's the uh, sorry it is too old doesn't have the USB sorry about that sorry my my camera so we can charge the camera as well What else? There's two more, and also for the USB C, we have the VR, and most importantly, we have this Arduino here. Which I previously programmed this one to do a flashing. So I able to control this one using a mobile phone. So in a later videos that we're going to upload, we're going to, to make, I'll show you also how to program this Arduino and uh, you should able to do it yourself and able to control it using your smartphone. So this one comes with a Bluetooth device, which connected to my mobile phone, which currently not connected. So that's pretty much it. So the next part is I'm going to mount this one in front next to the power board and let's do that. So now I place this one into the panel.
Now we have panel mount multi USB port, not only one, but two of them on both sides. Now we can use it to power up our inspection microscope. So stay tuned and we'll do more videos on in the, in the near future. The next the next part is we're still going to set up our um, electronic workbench. We'll uh, install the ESD mat and and more projects to come. And thanks for watching. I'll see you next time.